Hello ladies and gentlemen, uh, my name is Harley and today we are going to be continuing where we left off with House Mud now guys. So, um, game crashed again. I lost everything. Only thing I remember, I was married to her. <laughs> and that's the only thing I remember out this whole time. Now, we got 1,500 views on my house mud video, and I know everyone on from there is going to be wanting to hit me. I don't blame them. I would want to hit me too. But anyway, let's let's look at Mud King Christopher the Fourth. Ambitious, brave, diligent, zealous, rough, just. You know what I can say that. Legendary warrior, quick, strong, and a brilliant strategist. So, currently I tried to get back to where we were. Now, currently I've got no kids. That's fun. Uh, so, yeah, i got no kids. And, as soon as I say this, my wife gets pregnant. Uh, how convenient. Anyway, so, guys, currently I can't go war on anyone. On technicality, I can. On technica and then on gameplay, I can't. Now, I could attack the beam for, for say. But guess what? They're my religion. I could attack the Blackwoods. But they were my religion. I could attack the Bay of Claws. But they were my religion. The only people I can attack is the Brackens here. And they're kind of depleted. They're kind of, they're kind of shit at this point. So we're gonna go after them. Yep. We're going after the Brackens, ladies and gentlemen. Yep. Until Christopher dies, and then he he hopefully has a male. And then with his kid, with his kid, we can actually, you know, guess what, guys? We can actually attack. The Blackwoods, we're gonna attack the Bane Forts, we're gonna attack the Bay of Claws, we're gonna attack anyone we goddamn wish. Though at this current moment we cannot, so it's gonna be a tight, tight game right now. Oh, oh I'm saying it's gonna be a tight game, it's just gonna be it's gonna be difficult. Expansion wise, that's that's for sure. It's gonna be difficult for expansion. But um hopefully hopefully we can get the Trident's mouth. If we do, we can push for the god's shore as a duchy. Now that would help us a lot because then it would connect us to the god's eye. And with the god's eye we would be able to take all of these lands and seeing as they are part of the almost all of them are part of the Riverlands. So it's Stokeworth here, which I would actually leave to the king. And let say Stokeworth itself eat it up per se. I would let them eat it up. Uh yeah, that that'd be nice. So I wouldn't have to do much. And it would actually give me the nice dedicated land. Of the Riverlands, so basically, that's that's all we want at this point is a nice dedicated land of the Riverlands. Now, what are you trying to do? You're trying to fabricate House Malastar. What are you doing here? I say no. You, I say stop. You stop. If I say I want to shit on you, I can shit on you. <laughs> that's uh, that's how the democracy works. In my kingdom. And we have a daughter. Maybe. Oh, no. Okay. Succession does not work like that. That's, that's a shame. That's a real shame, actually. <sighs> can I change it? Women can inherit. But is there an eligible males? Women can inherit on the same grounds. Men do. I have to reign for 10 years. And I have to be at peace. Yeah, I think I can do one of those. Uh, one of these must be true. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe. Maybe I could do it. I'm not sure. I'm 
kind of hoping I can. I would actually like for my daughter to probably inherit, honestly. She's probably the most qual qualified person at this point. If you look throughout my kingdom and my family, hell, she's the most qualified besides me. Even a mother, like a person who's not even part of our religion, or she's part of our religion, alright. She's part of our religion, I'm sorry. Someone who's not part of our culture would be, would be better suited than anybody else. Now, guys, if you guys want me to play as a county in this, I'm not going to. Now, I want independence. How many people are in independence? I would lose Chilton and I would lose... Uh, no. Nah. I will not be blackmailed. I will not be blackmailed. Mate. There is nothing that you can do. I'll call my allies in for my independence. I guess their father died. Yeah, their father died, alright. Because they were definitely not. Okay. He's gonna come join me anyway. I think he's at war with somebody. Who are you at war with? You're not at war with anyone. I think he's trying to gather up all of his armies. Which, you know, he's taking his sweet ass time doing so. You know, so. Of course he'll join my war. He had no choice, basically. He was either going to join or I was going to... I don't know. Tristan's kind of zealous. Actually, no, he wouldn't kill her then. I was going to say he was going to kill her for her, her for her brother's impotence. Uh, but that doesn't sound like saying Shh, he would do. So uh, She got lucky. She got lucky, man. Uh, yeah, I've only got 4k. Yeah, I'm actually going to stay here. Nice to see that they won't declare war on me, but they do, they're at war with them. Well, they're at war. War for Lord Crystal Ridge. Bullshit. This Crystal Ridge is going to take one of these countries? Nah. Nah, man, nah. If you take that, I will see that as a direct war against my people. I'm not even joking. I will, I will kill, I will burn from Eastern Hill down to the Garden Wood. All Duskin Dale will burn. I'm not even joking. That's how much I'm actually gonna be pissed off if somebody from Duskin Dale takes a part of my land. Yep. Pretty serious. How much men does this guy have? 7k. If I can go and destroy this 2k, that would leave him with 4k. And then hopefully my Riverland buddies would be able to come in, swoop in, and just lay the egg. Uh, military speed has gone up. Pink Maiden, the Pipers are still here, which is nice. Uh, nice to see that the phrase haven't turned against me. Oh, we aren't zealous. Oh my gosh, somebody upstairs has heard me, guys. We can attack the Brackens. We can attack the Bay of Freaking Claws. Oh my gosh, okay, we can actually can't attack the Bay of Claws, but um, yeah, we we can attack the Brackens. You know, that's, that's good. Attack the Brackens, take their land. Actually, I'll, I'll only be able to take what the blue fork actually has a bit of shit. And I would only be able to take these, like, take the rest of the blue fork from these guys at the beam fort. Ah, that's actually not pretty good. Ah, I was expecting something better. Anyway, um, hmm. I would love to be with this army, but I'm not going with that army. I'm actually just going to go here, get my 12,000 troops back up. Hmm. Get, my, get get enough troops, hopefully. 7k against 5k, yeah. And they got another 5k coming up. Yeah, I'll, I'll stop too. I'll stop. Turn the other way and be like, nah, I'm out of here. I, I wouldn't even bother trying to fight that. Um, where are you going? The Frey Woods. Why are you going to the Frey Woods? Go to the... Martin's 
Martin Shaw. Okay, I guess it's not called the Twins yet. The West Tower. The East Tower, apparently. They called the East, West Tower and East Tower. And it's the High Lordship of the Twins. It's just not called the Twins. It's called Patrick's Hill and Martin Shaw. Okay. I'm actually going to march here. Allied attached. Order to attach with me. Does that mean that they will attach with me? I'm expecting them to all come to me to attach. Please. Owner has the order attached to my army. Okay, that's that's cool. That's cool. Okay, now I actually have probably a strong ass force, maybe. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Make it in time. Make it in time. My forces will not die. Oh, yes, thank God. Well, they broke it anyway. Probably help. They probably help, definitely. Okay, I'm gonna break off that order, and I'm just gonna march down to march down to Stilfen, Stilfen, mid Stilfen. That means I oh, so I'm gonna get river. I'm gonna get river guard. Ooh, hmm, gonna get river guard back hmm. for that river guard in a while. Ah, uh, they're, they're gonna go to red crossing. Then they're probably gonna go to old town. Old Stone, sorry. They're gonna go to Old Town. <laughs> yeah, they're gonna, they're gonna go to Old Town. <laughs> uh, you guys can just go and pillage a burn at this point. Uh, go away, you stupid piece of crap. Uh, come on. I just want to pillage a burn what lands they once had. Because hell, they aren't holding these lands anymore. It's gonna go to somebody who actually likes me. Um, apparently he owns all this land. Well, that's good. That's good to know. Uh, what are you doing? Um, what faction are you part of? Uh, that's, that's, that's not a worthy faction for me to worry about, mate. The independence faction, you should have, should have got somebody on that. Yeah, see the elective succession? That's, uh, that's probably something to worry about. Because if they do elective succession, there's no chance that um, it will be my kids. Though, hopefully, hopefully. Okay, this guy's in prison. Okay. I can demand a rel religious conversion. He will convert. I'm going to demand, I'm going to demand a re religion conversion for everyone. Uh, you you you're a te re you're a religious can I ransom him? 145 gold. How much gold do you have? Oof. I could banish him. We could execute him. Vassal, all my va you using this opinion is views to lower all vassal opinions. Oh, I'm gonna release him then. Um, do I have your kid? No. I don't have his kid. Well, it's gone up to 50 there. Um, okay, he's been religious. So they've been converted. So after converting him, he was released. So after converting him, he was released. Okay, so I'm gonna. I should ransom. I'm gonna ransom him and release her. He doesn't. And, um, okay, I can't do anything. That's nice. Hopefully nobody, apparently there's no faction, so that's, that's nice. Guys, I'm not sure what Tristan would have done there, but I'm glad that turned out how it did. That could have been a sticky situation. Okay. How much money do you have? You have 100, 100k. 1k, sorry, not 100k, okay, this is, how much men do you have? 7k, okay, I'm not going to deal with them in a while. Okay, I'm going to get there. I'm going to quickly declare war on them. I'm going to raise my troops, going to get old, old stones. 
Oh, he's called schooling at Old Town for some reason. It's Old Stones, though. Um, and it looks like Old Blackwood here might actually lose all the love of the land he once owned, which would actually be pretty funny. The Brackens would be the only ones left. I, de I definitely want to try to get a get a um a Tully if I could. Try to get a Tully in here. But um, oh, sorry guys, a bit tired. Oh, it's been a tiring day. Uh, I can't remember what I was talking about. <laughs> Gotta love that. Uh, anyway. Uh, we cannot declare war. War. Right now, if I can afford to lose 400. Uh, trying to work out who I could declare war next. So I just gotta wait two years. Then I might be able to get the Rapids. Could you imagine getting the Rapids at this point? Or maybe I'm getting Maiden Pool itself? If I got Maiden Pool itself, that would actually put me right next to the God's, the God's Eye. Which would actually let me be able to get the God Shore. Which would actually work in my favour more than anything else. So we actually might get made a ball itself. And then work on getting the rest of our land. Hmm. <sighs> They're taking everything. I take it all my forces are together. Awesome. Hmm. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, mate. Guys, I know. <laughs> I don't talk much in these videos. I'm more focused upon the game. But, um... When I do talk, I try to try to have some words of wisdom, shall we say. Let's go take Fair Market next. The Black Rush is also also owns Maidstone. Freaking hell. They're yawning though. So when my yawning is louder than me, half the time. All good though. All good. I'm actually tempted to call them allies. I want to find out who they're at war with at this moment. They're at war in a duchy. Oh, you're kidding. King in duchy. Oh, attacking. So they're. Do they just. I think they. So they. So they currently. That's a bummer. That means I'm gonna have to attack the Reach. In order to get all my land, I'm actually gonna have to attack the Reach. Which is something I hope I was hoping I wouldn't have to do. But things happen, man. What can you do? Anyway, so hopefully hopefully that they don't take it personally. And hopefully they get attacked from all sides or they get a massive rebellion. Even better, they might push against Old Town and Old Town might whack him in the ass. I don't know. Anything at this point would be good. Though I think we have the next Pope here. <laughs> uh, High King Garth. Garth. Garth man. Should just call him Garfield. King Garfield. I don't want to meet up with the Vances. They're currently not. They how the Blackwoods take that? Bugger off. Bugger off. That's a small ass garrison. What's my go? Two thousand. Yeah, see that's a that's a true garrison right there. What what about what about here? Uh yeah, one thousand five hundred. I'll take that. Yeah. That's a true garrison, right there. None of these bullshit garrisons. Well, why has this got such a bullshit garrison, man? 
720. How's Fan Market got more than the Black Forest? How? Raven Trees definitely was it. Sorry, guys, I'm just rambling along about random towns. Actually, I want to finish them off. Can I finish them off? I want to finish this war as quickly as I can. Set Council Power. Hunf Hunfred wants Council Power. Well, Hunfred. Should have spoken to me before you started conspiring against me, man. Who are you? Oh, oh well. Oh well. That ain't my problem, man. Uh, they eventually won't be my problem, which would be good. Uh, I'm actually going to push back into Rapid Shore. If I push back into Rapid Shore, I can kind of like just sit here for a bit. Which will be nice. Hmm, so, can I ask politely, mate? Oh, he's not in any, anything, so I don't have to. I don't want to provoke him into actually joining one if he's not in one. You know, that's what the game does. It's like, oh yeah, he's trying to conspire against you. He's currently not in one, as far as we know. But he might he might join one. Yeah, he might join one if I piss him off. Yeah, that's uh, that's smart, mate. I love your idea. Let's, let's, let's go piss him off, and he'll, he'll go join a faction against me. Smartest thing I've ever heard, mate. Thanks, mate. Bloody oath. Come on. I'm expecting them. Yeah, see. They were always going to go for the Black Forest. If I can just casually keep destroying whatever little force they can send, and I can build up my forces, then that would be nice. But, uh, yeah. So, 74%. Let's push back. It's kind of like a waiting game at this point. So they have 264 men going around. That's that's sad. How'd she lose an eye? She's a lunatic. Paige, get out of there, man. Oh, oh, who are you? Bugger off, mate. Why? Well, what I ever do to you? You got four kids. So be it. Surprise me. Yeah, all right. Surprise me, mate. Surprise me. Hopefully, hopefully it's something good, not some of this retarded shit. I would actually love for this war to be over at this point. Who is he? F oh, he's fighting these guys still. How? How? Oh, truce expires in 56 days. Oh, crap. That's the best news I've ever heard this whole video. Wait, while I'm playing. Uh sec. Bah. Bugger. Well, I don't know how many days it is now. Should be all good. 26th of July, yeah. It's less than a week. Okay, I'm gonna go take Maidenstone. And then once I got there, I'll probably leave my forces for a bit. Then we'll go take Maiden Pool. And then once we have Maiden Pool, you know, the victory we've been waiting for for such a long time will come and then we'll be able to take the red fork and the gods at the same time and I'll be able to take everything so fetch me the traitor evidence this seems fishy I shall not notify the supposed plotter yeah he's ambitious he probably is wrathful though he is brave and he's probably yeah, he probably, well, he's just, so he, probably, he wouldn't want to go on false, you know, false information, shall we say. Uh, okay, so, I'm going to go march to Loston now. He's in the factions. Oh, Seagull joined. I'm wounded. It's going to be so funny if I die. Now I get to play as this old fart, his old fart kids don't have, who are 20, oh my god, the 17 year old's married, but the 20 year old isn't, 
even the father's not married. Father was a bit young. Could have got married again, but God knows why he would have wanted to do that, you know. Not to continue on the family at all. Well, we got Scar now. Battle's over. War's over. You whippy. Bye bye. Okay. So now that's mine. Don't understand. What's going on? Increase cancer power. Ah, uh, yeah, right. We'll increase cancer power. I get an advisor. We'll get Mark of Sea River Guard, sorry. We'll get we'll, we'll get Marky here. Mark seems alright. Uh how much men do you have, mate? Yeah, yeah. Claim on the red. Rapid keep. We can do a Dutchy invasion there or a Dutchy invasion there. Which Dutchy invasion helps me the most? This one. Oh, why is pregnant? Actually, how much men do I have? Five. Yeah. Okay, I, I do outnumber them. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna go into this absolutely blind as shit. Blind as shit. <laughs> Anyway, we're gonna raise our troops. I'm gonna. Of course, I was actually gonna hope I could get these guys. Apparently not allies anymore. There's no one I can get. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. Jerry, it is then. The reason why he just. I don't know why he hasn't got his men up and running. Don't tell me. He won the war? Holy crap. He won the war. Yeah, you don't expect that shit at all. Uh, the monument upon unrevealing notice of the. Cr um. Uh, yeah, he's not humble. He's ambitious. He's like, I want everyone to know. I'm like the king, man. Like, um, I'm the bomb, basically. Yeah. yeah. Uh. Okay, we got a thousand men. We could do a quick engagement against the Bay of Claws. Your vassal lord with his wife. It's none of my business, man. Yeah. They wanna fight, they can fight. They wanna shit on each other, they can shit on each other. That ain't got anything to do with me. <laughs> nope. Nothing to do with me. Apparently I can do imprison him. I can even imprison him. I can imprison both of them. That's that's interesting. Oh crap! They got a quick engagement on me, but I actually won that. <laughs> How did I win that? How did I win that? That's the question. Oh, why are these guys standing there? See, there's an extra five hundred men, which is just gonna stand there now. I'm always waiting on my men. No joke. Always waiting. Oh my gosh, thank god. I get we got eight hundred men now. I can wait. I can wait for them now. I agree to wait for them. So they that is stillborn daughter. And since you have split stillborns they actually don't turn up because apparently they are so you know, they happen so much, you just they just don't turn up. Yeah. I have a son. He's quick. Thank God. Oh my God. Okay, we're just gonna randomize it. No, we're actually gonna do. Okay. Three, two, one. Prince pa Patrick of the River and Hills. I think this is Patrick. 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 What's oh, you know? Probably does. It's just the way that they like spell this shit. Weird as hell. Anyway, Let's, we got 28 seconds, guys. I got 28 seconds to get my armies all together. Holy crap! 44 men. Wait, we can win this quick, quick engagement, maybe, maybe, maybe. Uh, yes. And cavalry comes in with the 800 men. No, 900 men now. There's 6,000 men now. That's, that's, that's actually pretty good. 
And there goes the timer. Yeah, all right, shut up. Stop it. Gosh. Okay. Guys, I hope you guys did enjoy this. And if you did, make sure to smash that like button. And I'll see you guys next time. And make sure to give this video lots of love like you have given all the others. So I'll see you guys next time.